I guess sports can get pretty nasty among your competitors. Since her shoes were destroyed once she was chosen to start, it must have been a girl on the track team. But that doesn't exactly narrow it down. A girl on the track team with a fairly long career, who also happens to be an amazing sprinter, and who uses the same brand of spikes as does Ariaki the second year. The person is therefore left-handed, reads the Fukuruma newspaper, and lives in Block 23. That is our culprit. Uh -huh. The culprit ruined these shoes with recently purchased scissors. And she was incredibly precise when tearing out the seams. It would seem that she has studied this before because she had to have known the exact weak points of an old pair of these spikes. And most important of all, she left the logo untouched when she destroyed these shoes. Hmm. This may sound strange, but the culprit probably has an attachment to this brand of shoes. One glance at the cut makes it clear. Look! Clearly, left-handed scissors were used. What am I looking at? And what does the Fugaruma newspaper have to do Shine with Shine a light at the letter. Examining the text on the back, you can determine that they were taken from random issues of this past week's mm. Fugaruma newspaper. The culprit didn't specifically buy a newspaper to make this letter. Oh, no, sir, she did not. She must have used old newspapers lying around the house. And you say she lives in Block 23, right? Newspapers may change depending on when they were printed. The clippings used in the letter came from the 14th edition only delivered to Block 23. She's obviously a subscriber. Her powers of deduction are insane! I'm seriously freaked out! And she remembers every word! Only a few people in the world should fit the profile I just described. Now let's track down the culprit. Denying a person's hard work. Interfering with someone's hard work to improve that I despise such behavior. I am angry, Zenkichi, and in response to my anger, the suggestion box requests.